Okay, starting up round two here. We got John with us again. And we still have a panharmonic on. We do. We decided it was like real cute and flashy and it'd be fun. This is definitely a keep. We got this construct going on. Okay, they mold to six. I like our opponent's name. Risk it for biscuit. Mm -hmm. I say that a lot. Oh. Limp it for biscuit. <laughs> Limp it for biscuit. Now we're in a biscuit. Oh, a sky skiff. Okay. Our old friend sky skiff. So I think we want to make sure we hit a lands. Sure. So I think we want to do the construct here versus grubs. Because I want to make sure we can drop this on turn three. Cool. You did your job, little buddy. Good shiny guy. Okay. And then our opponent bottomed. So dang, we helped them out. Did they power bottom? What's a power bottom? Nothing. Don't say that on my YouTube videos. <laughs> Getting whacked with the skip. Uh, you're inappropriate. It's Freighter, right? Yes. It's always Freighter. It's not always Freighter, but it's it's Freighter a good bit of the time. This is Freighter.format. The card is just insane. It's broken. I remember one time I had a deck with three of them, and I just loved my life. It was great. It should definitely be uncommon. Yeah, it's, too, it's very strong, for sure. I think it's a lot of what pushes the format into a super aggressive format. Makes sense. It doesn't it, go in every deck, though. But it goes in every color. Yeah, but it, it shouldn't really be in a blue deck. Um, do we want to take a turn off to Panharmonic on up? I don't think so. Um, we could. I think getting in for a ton of damage is pretty nice. I mean, they have a timing, probably. So I want to make sure that we can build to smash the freighter. So throw out an artisan. Not Oh, right now, okay. Yeah, because we want to um, crew with the artisan. We're going to make a servo here, right? Yes. Okay. So, yeah, I didn't want to play Panharmonic on out. I think this is better. It would give us an extra servo and extra energy. Right, but we... But we get in for two more damage here and put creatures on the board. Probably be winning before that matters. Yeah. That's what this card is. It's kind of like, oh, well, it's like a... It's if you run out of gas, it'll maybe get you a little more gas. Well, it's like a bow on the present, you know? Like, they're very unnecessary. Sure. Ninth Bridge is cute, but they might be dead by the time it's relevant, so... So we should... Spire side. Yeah. Or you could even go to a couple two drops, but this lets you hold up build to smash. Yeah, I like this. Correct. So... And that just gets in damage right away. It's yeah. nice. Now if they crew with their skiff to block something, you can build to smash. Whatever. Yeah. This is fine. Just attack. Everything's fine. Flunge. Mm -hmm. God, this deck is great. I wish I could have this all day, every day. If only we had more built to smash. I know. Such a good card. So they're just dead. Like actual? Okay. If, they, if that was their only block, are they still just dead? Yeah, they're just dead. Because they have white, which is gonna not, yeah, they're dead. That's exactly lethal. Turn five kills feel good. <laughs> oh my. They feel good. Okay. Do we do we want to just take this stupid thing out? <laughs> I think but the spark is good. Spark? Okay. Because your deck wants to be really low to the ground and efficient, and that's exactly what that card is. And it gets a land out of the way. I'm. I just really wanted to try Panharmonicon. Ah, this is too many lands. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Oh, well, I wasn't suggesting that you maul that, but. I think the maul was correct. This is probably keepable. Okay. Five lands is too many. No? You yeah. would have kept it? I think I would have kept it. Really? Oh. Really, really. Is this a hand where a freighter is not correct? Uh... No. Freighter's correct. <laughs> <laughs> that uh, compan compagnon, as they say in France, <laughs> in France, was a very good draw. Yes. Okay. Well, gross. 
I'm not blocking that though. No. Am I? I don't think so. I think we catch up pretty quickly in the damage race. Um, it's still freighter. Yeah. And we don't want to lose our companion to the artisan, so we don't attack. Right. It can't attack. Oh, right. It, like, literally can't attack. Right. It's too trusty for that. Right. Is that a leash or, like, a phone cord? I don't think it's a phone. It looks like a phone cord to me. I don't think that the <laughs> hyena that you're seeing is actually a phone. <laughs> so are we taking five? Or are we... No. Oh. You want two blocks already. Oh, crewing freighter. And blocking the 2-2. Two, two. Oh, no. I didn't mean to hit F2, my B. I guess you're taking five now. Okay. Should we have crewed with freighter? Um, it would be a thing to consider for sure. Well, you're not casting Inspire Charge here. No, I'm casting Artisan. Or Gremlins. We're getting beat down pretty hard. Yeah. Um, With this blue white deck, they're they're all white though. It's okay. It's no, no blue beats. It's white beats. What happens if we go artisan now, dragster next turn? Is that better than gremlins now, artisan next turn? I don't think that we are attacking at all. So. Period. Wait, we're not. I don't think so. They probably have a timing. Okay. If you're not attacking at all, play the gremlins, right? Because it's a 2 3, it blocks their 2 2. I don't think we can attack here. I think that's like really risky. Okay. So, yeah, let's play all the gremlins, and next turn we can go dragster. No, that's not well, even good. Glint sleeve was better for the dragster. Right. Next turn we can go glint sleeve, then into dragster. I don't know, this got complicated really quick. Oopsie daisies. We are getting pretty beat up. So now we're just blocking the 3 2 that we didn't block immediately? Yep. Well, at the time it didn't seem right to block it, but now it feels like we need to. Oh. Mm -hmm. Dang. Alright, so Fragmentize comes in. Right. Sure. No attacks. Oh, okay. That's cool with me. I think it's just Glint. And then send the uh, Gremlins. It just gets blocked when we get in for one damage. Maybe they don't block it. It wants to attack. Okay. They're at 20. I don't think they block it. Send Companion, too. Okay, cool. Now we can hit for a lot next turn. With a drag star, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's not block the 3 2. With the artisan, for sure. For sure. Unless they play a cog worker's plus on that. That's fine. Theorist is A okay with me. Although it's a pretty good blocker for a drag star. Yeah. Them not attacking is kind of cray cray. This yeah. wants to attack. It doesn't want to be a 1 1. Come on. Yeah. Um, okay. So we could. We're not quite in inspired charge territory. We're not. No. So do we play out the dragster and not attack with it and set ourselves up for an inspired charge next turn? Is that insane? That's a little crazy. Like, just attack with the gremlins? If we did that? This is awkward. I don't think Construct's the play. It's not strong enough. So, if, what if you dragster attack with everything? So that's then we, we do we cool. die on the crackback? I guess not. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Attack with everything. So they probably block the dragster with whatever something, which is fine. 
Because then we're setting ourselves up for an inspired charge next turn. Yeah, I think that just so, that I think so it's good. Damage. Yeah, I agree. So let's hold up um, a belt alas. Yeah, with three gremlins, I really wish I would have got a white puzzle knot. I'm so sad. Maybe don't send the artisan. They still have a. Not just send the artisan. I think it's fine. They're nowhere near killing us on the crack wreck. Unless they have an inspire charge, which I doubt they have one in blue white. That would be really weird. They shouldn't. Right? And that's no. not. Is that even lethal? Probably not. Okay, so this puts them to like five. No. They're ten. Okay. I mean, I knew they had timing. We already knew that. They were like signaling it earlier. They're like, hey, I have it. Yep. So that was going to come at some point. Dang. Ooh. That's bad. Well, shoot. So they're getting in for what? Three here? Yep. I don't think they send theorists. They might. Hmm. I like when Scry Guys attack. Okay. I was like, don't you want to see your cards, bud? Hmm. Okay. Anywho. That's a good draw. Kind of. It's good in the fact that we can do two things. Yeah, play it. We don't want the mountain. Correct. Do we want the gremlins? Not really, because we're not really... It's pretty slow. Yeah. I think we just want to see what else we can get. Let's do it again. Because I don't think we're attacking here. No. It doesn't behoove us to do it. That was a lot of scry. We got our scry on. Trading on 2-2 two, two for a servo. Or I mean a thopter. Does that behoove you? Probably. Wait, we bottomed. Here, right? Yes. I bottomed, they topped. Okay, so if we attack with artisan and servo... No, let's just leave up. Don't that keep it's our bad. Alive for what are you talking team? about? They block like this and like this. We're not attacking with servo. Oh, if we, block, if we attack with artisan, they just block it. Like what? Okay, or they could kill it. They could double block it. Oh, double block with a theorist and a thopter. I think they probably just block it. Yeah. So I think it's better just to leave it back. Okay. It's not very good for us though, because now they have four power in the air. And first strike on that door. Oh, what do I do about that? Chump? Because if we don't chump, we're dead in the air next turn. Can we win with Inspire Charge? I don't think so. Because they have three blockers. So. Um, I think we if lose. If we chump it and attack Inspire Charge next turn. That wipes their board, right? And they're left with a... We're taking five here, so we're going to three. Oh, wait, no. We're, we're taking two. To... We can go to six. Okay. <sighs> so you're thinking we chomp the servo. Then we'll be at six. Then the next turn we inspire charge, clear their board, and, and then, then they have... They can hit us back to one. So to jump or not to jump, that is the question. There's no way I they think, don't block stuff, right? Like there's no way that yeah. we get through with this. Yeah. So we have to jump. I think we have to jump. Okay. Stupid first strike. This thing is like way better than I thought it was. Well, we should have killed it like a bajillion years ago. Yeah. Okay. Now we're just attacking. Because we have to. Desperation, attack, don't block any of it. Hmm. At least they, they're blocking wrong. Not really, because if... Not. We're just dead or dead. Or we're dead. Yeah, we're dead. If they don't block with the PFAL, we're dead. Oh. Yeah, that's a better block. Okay, we're still dead like this. Are we? No, if they block with everyone. We're still pretty dead. Yeah. 
because there's no way we can do nine damage to them in a turn and kill all their crap. Fumigate, which is actually not in our deck. <laughs> that would be a good draw here. Which maybe we bring it back in. I don't know. I don't think so. I think we still want to be faster than them. Yeah. And we just made a mistake of taking a million damage from, from the exemplar. Thing. Uh, so we're going to, oh, they're leaving back a Thopter? I guess that's probably right, because it doesn't change their cloak. We thought we could catch up, but the malfunction, oh. that's bad. We're just dead. Yeah. Okay, game three. Um, so we, I think we take out the apprentice. Oh, no, we didn't have that in. Um, I think Fragmentize needs to come in. Yep. But take out the spark, or what? Mm. I don't want to cut down on creatures because we have three vehicles, so I think we should be at 15. Sure, take out the spark. Uh, Fumigate would have been nice there, but yeah, I don't think in general. I think on the play we'll be okay. No? Nice. Sounds bad. <sighs> yeah. Because we have a skiff that we can't crew. If we draw a planes, it's okay. How many planes do we have? Eight. We're eating eight. We can mulligan if you think that's what we have to do. You would mulligan? It's borderline. I know, because it really doesn't do anything unless we draw a creature for this to be crude, or we draw... We have to draw red creatures or planes. We could do worse, though. That's the thing. Eh. Mull it? A lot of two drops and stuff. I think the deck mulls well. Okay. Yeah. The construct's here, so if we get I'll a land... Yeah, I think that we should keep it, too. And just hope really hard for a land... Because going to five sucks. So let's not do that. Okay, so they're going to decide if they're going to mull again. Oh, it's five o'clock. Got to eat some dindins. I want a pizza for dinner. Mmm, mmm, pizza. What are you going to have for dinner? Food, most likely. Oh, okay. Them. Get me a land. Land! Those one land keeps. But going to five is bad. Land. Oh, we're so screwed. <laughs> okay, we lose. Maybe they kept a one land. Nope. No such luck. Land. We're dead. <laughs> punished. Maximum punishment. I think if we hit it now, we're not completely dead. Just means we have a lot of gas. Mm hmm. Maybe they drew off the crane. Bad bird. That crane is flying a sky skip. That makes no sense. Why not? Oh go. my. Okay. Construct. Yeah. We want to make sure we hit our lands. Yes. Like badly. Okay. This is going to be like climbing a mountain, but we can do it. Captain Kirk is climbing a mountain. Why is he climbing a mountain? <laughs> Buddy, find us a land. Because if we can go gremlins into Servo Exhibition, that's pretty good. Yeah. Well, gremlins into Artisan into Grubs and Servo Exhibition. Okay. Or glem gremlins into gremlins. What? Find me a land. You're not a land. <laughs> Everything that's not a land is getting brought on. I mean, we had plays. Mm -hmm. Owen was raving about how good Construct is on a stream today. <laughs> That's great. I've been yeah. saying this card is great for a long time. I'm happy that somebody else is saying it as well. Hmm. Especially someone as respected as Owen Turtenwald. He is indeed respected. Mm -hmm. I think I have to kill that whale. Yeah, you gotta kill that whale. 
Kill it with lightning. Like right now. Yes. Yeah. And then I guess we're attacking because <laughs> what else are you gonna do? We can't block them by us. What else am I gonna do? I don't know. Cry. Because we're not hitting our lands. It's very sad. This is a hand that could steal the game. They're not hitting white. Yeah. They do keep hitting us for three, really stupid. Fragmentize would be a good job. Crane and skiff. <sighs> okay. Sigh. Is it probably just companion? Oh, wait. That don't make no sense. Yeah, I mean, it's still probably just that. And then what? Just like not attack with. Uh, I guess we're still attacking though, because they can hop this. Yeah, and it. Mm, <sighs> it what? Uh, actually. Grubs? Yeah, just send it. That forces them to hop if we would hold it back, but... We have a ton of mana. Ugh. This is so There's gross. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Tears of straight up sadness. Fragmentize. Oh, except for it doesn't hit a mess of them. Yep. I think we did. Yep. I think we would have been like okay if we would hit land sooner. Yeah. Huh? A fast deck not playing things on curve is really bad. Yeah. Okay, we're dead. Like dead actual? Well, Two, not three, four, yet, five. But like can't do they it. They can hit us for five in the air two turns in a row. Hmm. So anyway we can do sixteen damage. Let's figure this out. We're hitting them for five, they go to eleven. So we have a gremlin's back. Uh, but we have to block. It's not like we could even not block with this. Well, I guess we can block with the companion. So we can block here. Then the Gremlins is going to be able to do a bunch. We might be able to get through this. I didn't quite math this out, but I think this is our out. If we can play a Servo Exhibition next turn. We have to block with the companion on the Mastodon. Yep. It's going to be really tight. But if we can draw a Bill to Smash... And they just do nothing. <laughs> we No, they have to attack out, and we have to draw a Bill to Smash. Nothing. Oh, which they have five cards in hand. But we have an out. But we need th that exact draw, I believe. So everybody just think really hard about Build to Smash and what it looks like and how glorious it is and how much we would like it right now. That's not a Build to Smash. No, that's like really bad. That kind of ruins my whole game plan. Yeah, the game plan was pretty fragile to begin with. Mm. Now we have to chomp. <sighs> and that has vigilance. So yes. we have to chomp though. Yes. We can't just double block it because then we have no recourse for winning. So we have to go like this. I still think we have no recourse for winning. If they wouldn't have played this dang serpent, it might have been um, okay. I still think <laughs> there was no way we could win this game. Ugh. This doesn't do anything. I know. What are you doing? <laughs> Just playing it out. Because I'm stubborn. Dang it. Dern. Okay. You can concede. I know. Go to the next match. This is the last match. Oh, this is the last game. Next match. Okay. <sighs> Sigh. Well, we made a mistake in game two, so. And that cost us the whole game? Whole match, yes. Okay. By not blocking. <sighs> Dang it, I'm sorry guys. I thought we could catch up. But anyway. If we hit the land in like the first couple turns. For this one. Yes. We would have been fine. Yeah. But so we could have went to five, but who knows what that would have brought. Probably nothing but Right. Okay. Alright, cool. Sorry y'all. No 3 0 for us today. Anyway, we'll be back again for the third round in a little bit. See you then.